But the fact that they are targeting uh, children specifically and plan to target them in a massive way uh, within 10 years is just stunning. Um, and I think it shows that these people really think um, they cannot be stopped. And it's really, you know, uh, I would argue up to um, concerned parents and concerned citizens um, to protect the most vulnerable from this type of invasive technology. You're listening to The Corbett Report. Welcome back, friends. James Corbett here, CorbettReport.com, in a conversation that's being recorded on the 6th of July, 2021. And I- what she describes as the mechanical mismatch uh, between humans and, and machines, it really three different components. Um, and it and is frankly just um, mind boggling. So I would honestly, uh, if this sounds unbelievable to you, I would encourage you to go to either Welcome Leaf's website or my article and read the official document describing what this program is, which they abbreviate as 1KD, a much shorter version. Basically what they want to do initially is uh, surveil 
through various means, uh, including wearables, eye tracking technology, 24-7 surveillance of uh, the youngest children um, in order to risk stratify them, predict their responses to interventions in uh, their developing brains um, for, for various reasons. But the, the first uh, goal is to basically use uh, this access to, to children's brain brains to map them on a on a massive scale as many kids as possible in order to develop what they call the second goal an in silico model of a human developing brain um, essentially you know uh, something as close as they can really get uh, to the singularity uh, basically uh, you know machine intelligence that rivals and surpasses human intelligence which has not happened. Uh, up to this point, but it has been an open goal of futurist and transhumanist um, people like Ray Kurzweil, the Google Google's former futurist, have been very um, open about uh, the desire for the singularity and how a lot of these people think that uh, this AI-powered control grid cannot actually be established until a singularity is developed and and present. So they essentially um, are looking to create a, a prototype. Uh, an artificial neural network that would essentially be a model for that uh, by um, mapping and, and surveilling really uh, the brains of, of babies and toddlers in order to presumably uh, from there have something that develops a brain, uh, artificial brain model that develops from, from there like a normal human would over time. But
post not in. Post it. Cubist inversion. Auto relocation of values. Market divide by sustainability rather than Cubist inversion. Auto relocation of supply in a recession can be a positive.
That's not where the program ends. Um, beyond that, what they want to do then is once they have this model of the uh, perfect, I guess you could say, developing brain, uh, they want to the then go ends. to, within um, 10 years, 80% the of children once they have this and model use the, that model uh, to perfect, um, assess say, children's brains brain, to see if they uh, fit they this to model or not, to, and if they uh, do uh, not fit it, it, to intervene in their developing brain so they fit this AI model of the correct brain, which in the hands of these people 
is just totally nuts. And honestly, talking about this, even as I was writing it, it's really hard to find words uh, to describe what this is. But really, you know, if allowed to advance specifically to that third stage, uh, could easily eliminate human creativity, uh, cre uh, the capacity for imagination uh, at a critical time in, in a human being's development. Um, and if you, uh, when we get to the last program, you know, it becomes pretty clear that, that Welcome Leap has an agenda like that um, for adults as well. But the fact that they are targeting uh, children specifically and plan to target them in a massive way uh, within 10 years is just stunning. Um, Thank you. 
just try associating yourself with groups forever. In their hundreds of thousands of followers, compare to your meager amount and you will know instantly the feeling. False virtue will designate these lines, and those that try to subvert or resist these distinctions will be quickly identified as ridiculous or pathetic, which will soon devolve to unvirtuous, unclean, or untouchable. Thank <laughs> you. 
and I think shows that these people really think um, they cannot be stopped. And it's really, you know, uh, I would argue up to um, concerned parents and concerned citizens and I think um, shows to protect the most vulnerable really think, from this type of invasive technology. Um, but it's, it's honestly, please go and read this document specifically. And I would actually uh, argue that the person responsible for overseeing this, who is a, a doctor in, in England uh, named Holly Baines, you should send her emails to let you know what you think about this program because a lot of these people running this stuff um, are academics that are not used to public pushback. Uh, you know, obviously be polite be responsible, but these people should be aware that the general public does not like the avenues their research um, is taking and what it could mean uh, for human society or the human species um, as a whole. And that's true also for these other programs, almost all of which rely on, on academics and universities um, in various countries throughout the world. Um, yeah, well, on that note, let me just interject. Yes, Holly Baines is the program director, but they have a handy dandy list of what they call selected performance. Performers. The handy dandy list of what they call selected performers. selected performers
Mm hmm. That green pen thing that I got from the shop, that pillow, that has a like light on it. Oh, so, yeah, do you know where where does it put it? I can't find it. I put it in. I put it in that box, but it's not there mm -hmm. anymore. Uh, that, that green pen thing that I got from the shop, that pillow, that has a like, light on it. Oh, so, yeah, do you know where
there is a next time. Never assume anything. Nothing anything. Nothing at all.